Before the video begins, ladies and gentlemen, a quick PSA for those that don't know, I have a second channel called Crash Talks and More, where I talk about more serious things as well as some cringe humor. Now, on to the video. Hi! How's it going everyone? You got your boy Corey here, aka Crasher, bring you guys a new exciting video. Ladies and gentlemen, let's get to it. Alright ladies and gentlemen, so what it is we got going on in this other reaction slash review type of video, and we have ourselves another video from the channel Konico, and it's titled, What if Red was actually a bad guy? So, this right here is going to be very interesting to say the least. I cannot wait to see what takes place here in this video. So with that being said, ladies and gentlemen, please be sure to show the original video some love. Links to all stuff will be in the description box down below. Without further ado, guys, let's begin with this. Here we go. All right. I'm excited for this. And oh, here we go. Okay. All right. Pick your starters. I'll let you pick oh. first. All right. Let's see what Red's going to choose. Oh, oh, Charmander. Charmander. Great choice. Okay. In that case, All right. I'll pick Squirtle. Of course he would, because he wants no. to choose. Oh, wait. Huh? Uh oh. I'll take all three of them. Oh. What? Don't be weird, Red. Okay. I'm sorry, Red. I'm afraid <laughs> you can only have one Sada Pokemon. Fair is fair. Oh. Charmander, get them. Oh. Oh no! Oh no! Oh well, at least he didn't kill them. <laughs> but he stole all the starters, though. <laughs> Grandpa! Uh oh. <laughs> what are you doing sitting around? Go get him! Well, how can he? Oh, Grandpa! I don't have any Pokemon yet! It, exactly! Uh, how right. can he if he has no Pokemon? A few hours later. Let's see this now. He's a Charmeleon now! Mm, nice. Alright. I'll take everything you've got. Um. <laughs> okay. Everything? That's right. Everything. Now hurry up! Let's see this uh, now. Yes, sir. Right away. <laughs> All right. Uh -huh. Let's see this Good. now. Let's go, Charmeleon. Uh, Wait. Sir, what is Wait it? Wait a second. Your payment? Oh. oh. You desire compensation for the privilege of servicing <laughs> the needs of Red? <laughs> but those aren't free, sir. That is you true. Have to pay for them. Silence. <laughs> That's a bit too pricey. And if I were to pay you, it would make me look weak. I can't tolerate that oh. sort of reputation. Charmeleon. Burn the store down. What? Oh no, don't do that! No, sir! You can't! Oh, oh no! Disrespect! And the store owner, too. Oh no! Oh, oh jeez. Run! No! Run! Oh no. Few more hours later. Alright. Hey, did you hear? <laughs> Team Rocket is getting more evil and rich every day. Oh. Huh. Wait a second. Maybe I should pay them a visit. Oh! Oh, is that it? Oh, oh no! No! I wanted to see Red pay them a visit. Oh. Well, I can't wait to see. I uh, can't wait to see how uh, the continuation plays out and all that stuff. What? What the hell? Oh my god! Wow. Wow, that, that ended on a cliffhanger, man. I wanted to see more out of this. All right, ladies and gentlemen, you know what time it is. It's evaluation time. So let's get started here. So this video opens up with Red, Blue, and Professor Oak in the Professor Oak Laboratory. And we know the classic scene where you are first to pick your starter. And then your rival, of course, picks the starter that has a type advantage over yours. Well, Red wasn't exactly having that and decided to take all three of the starters, leaving Blue with Nada, with Zilch. And that, of course, resulted in Charmander clobbering both Blue and Professor Oak. And I'm just like, what the hell, man? It's just, it was absolutely hilarious. And I'm like, you know what? That's one way to get the job done by stumping your rival. He doesn't have any Pokemon now to defend himself with. He doesn't have any Pokemon to battle Red with. And Red makes off with all three of the starters. 
absolutely brilliant. Why couldn't we have that be an option in the main series Pokemon games? Come on, Game Freak. I want to see that happen. And then, of course, we get to the scene where Red and Charmeleon are in the Pokemart, and of course, Red wants everything in the store, and the store clerk, you know, got everything organized and all that stuff, and then he's about to walk out, and then the store clerk's like, well, wait a second, you gotta pay for all that shit. Well, here's the thing, man, is that I really, really don't think you should have done that, because that incurred the Red of Wrath and his Charmeleon to pretty much thrash the whole store, as well as the owner. I gotta say, I felt so bad for that poor store clerk that probably gets paid minimum wage in that situation. I mean, that right there, dealing with a rogue trainer and a rogue Pokemon is probably way above his pay grade, you know? I just would have dipped and said, you know what? Fuck this shit. I'm out, man. You can have everything in the store. I don't want to get burned alive. And then, of course, we get to the final scene where we have two adults that are talking about Team Rocket, and we have Red saying that he wants to pay them a visit, and then the video ends. I'm like, come on, man. I wanted to see this go down, but... This right here, I gotta say, was a really, really hilarious video overall. I will say I didn't exactly appreciate the cliffhanger because I wanted to see how Red would respond to meeting Team Rocket. Like, it just would have been something really epic to see, which is why I'm hoping that we get, like, a continuation from this video, so that way it turns into kind of like a progressive series, if you know what I mean. So all in all, ladies and gents, this vid is going to get a 10 out of 10. My only small nitpick is that I really, really wish we could have gotten a little bit more out of it, and instead, we end up getting a cliffhanger to it all, and I was like, come on, man. But then again, it's like, you know, your boy don't like cliffhangers, so that right there, you know, probably just my own opinion and all that stuff but all in all I gotta say the video itself was absolutely solid I loved the portrayal of Red being a complete douchebag it was just absolutely hilarious to see the tables turn on Blue because typically Blue is portrayed as the douchebag rival but instead in this situation here we have Red being the douchebag and I'm like well shit son that right there was just absolutely crazy. I loved it. So this video is going to get a 10 out of 10 regardless. So with all that being said, ladies and gentlemen, that is going to be a wrap up for the video. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And I also hope you guys enjoy the haircut as well. I got it done earlier today. Hopefully I look a little bit more appealing in the video and not look like a shaggy caveman or something like I did before. But anyways, guys, thank you for watching. Have yourself a wonderful day or night, depending on your time zone. If you enjoyed the video, you know what to do leave a like subscribe and most importantly guys smash it up in the comments down below because i love 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 hearing from you guys always have always will that you're gonna change baby Woo! so thank you guys for watching and i'll see you guys in the next one